<laughs> Alrighty guys, welcome back. We are doing another Elite Trainer Box opening of the Celebrations Pack. I'm excited for these, man. Like, there are some amazing cards in here. Um, as you guys would have seen previously, we've opened up this guide before. You know what it's all about. Um, I'm, I'm really, really keen to get the Mew. The Gold Mew is 100% what I'm after. Um, we would also, I like the Gardevoir, that's pretty cool, the Mew, the Shining Magikarp, I've got that original car, which is fantastic, um, the Starters, any of those, even getting the Charizard, the Charizard is worth selling so that I can buy another one of the packs if need be, um, it'd be great to get the Zephrom as the counterpart, um, and I believe that the Lele is actually the rarest card as of recording this video, um, so if, if we pull any new secret rares, I'll be pretty happy with that. Oh, we've got a pack stuck in the uh, top part of it there. Um, so what we're going to do is we're actually going to only open the Celebrations ones. Um, and we're going to do the rest of them as a on-stream reward for uh, if people do subs and whatnot. Because that's, that's the sort of thing we like to do. Uh, we got all the sand standard stuff in here, including the Greninja, which looks pretty cool. Um, and I'll give you guys a code card as well in here. So that's the code card and we should be able to easily see everything that's going on. It does prove how dirty this uh, mouse mat is, so I need to fix that. And I'm thinking I might grab the scissors again, so just give me a second. Uh, where are they? There they are. Alright, so... I know that you can rip the tops off, but uh, I'd rather it a little bit safer and just make sure that we're doing right you know all right code card now there's not going to be any of the like base set ones here so it's basically the third and the fourth card i think that we're interested in the most so we've got the yveltal we've got cosmog we've got reshiram unfortunate and we got Professor's Research, so a bit of a dud on the first pack in comparison to uh, what we have got before. Um, but hey, we're still okay with that. I'm hoping to pull some of the good cards. The Mew would be fantastic if I pull the Mew, man. Oof. I will be one very happy lad. Um, I'm just trying to think of what else. The Umbreon, it's the Umbreon and the Mew, basically. Umbreon and Mew, if we pull either one of those, then that's fantastic. Um, otherwise, any of the starters, um, the original starters are really cool. So we've got the Lugia, Cosmoium, we've got ho -Oh, and we've got Solgaleo. Wow, two duds in a row, basically. Um, it's unfortunate, but I'm hoping that we can pull... I don't know, two secret rares would be great, um, but as you guys would have seen in the last trainer box that we opened, um, my mate Jay got, how many was it? Five. He got five secret rares in his uh, elite trainer box. So it makes me think that surely, 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 surely we'll be able to get like at least three. Cosmog, Yveltal, we've got Zekrom, and we got Solgaleo three in a row where I have not got anything. Come on, man. I was I was sort of concerned opening up this box because I was like, mm, well, it'd probably be cheaper just to buy the cards individually and whatnot. But I was like, no, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna buy one more just to just to see if I can manage to pull the uh, Umbreon or one of the starters. Or the shiny Mew. Shiny Magikarp would also be good as well. So we've got the Groudon, we got the Reshiram, we got the Palkia, and we got a Zamazenta. So Zamazenta is the first one that's been sort of cool, I guess, but even so, it's not one of the ones we're after, man. That's actually ridiculous. If we get through all these packs without like any secrets or anything, I'm not going to be happy at all. Possibly be the worst box ever recorded. Alright, code card. Let's hope for something good this time. So we got the Dialga. We got Xerneas. 
<gasps> yes, we got the Mew. That's awesome. All right, look at that. So there you go. We got the Mew Secret Rare. That's a new one for us. And we got the Full Art Pikachu. Very cool. All right. Mew, brand new one for us. We're going to put him just over at the side here. That is fantastic. I was hoping to pull the Mew card. Um, I think, although it might not be uh, cost-wise that expensive, um, it is definitely a very cool card. So, yeah. Uh, we got the camera stuffing up on us as well. Don't know what's going on with it. When I was trying to uh, set it up today, it was not having a bar of it. So if we can get through this recording without it uh, stuffing up, then I will be happy. All right. So we got the Zekrom card. We got Yveltal. We've got <gasps> Klepper. We already have this card. Oh, this one seems like hollow all over. Is that like an error or something? Because I swear the last one was not like that. And we also got a Mew. That's cool. All right. So Mew is obviously not as special. It is probably one of the rarer ones out of the like common cards, I would say. Um, but the Clapper, we get another secret rare. So we got two secret rares there. And yeah, it's actually weird. Like it seems very shiny and everything, which is cool. Um, are we going to be able to open this? I think we can open it. There you go. It's like our first pack that we've been able to open without having to cut it. All right. Then we've got a code card. There we go. And then we can check these packs. So we start off with the Yveltal. We've got the Xerneas. We've got ho -Oh. And we've got Lunala. Lunala is probably a little bit more rare out of uh, out of a lot of them, but uh, yeah, I don't know. Still nothing nothing too uh, crazy there. Um, two secret rares so far, with only three packs to go. I'm hoping we can pull at least one more. Uh, one more secret. One more secret would be good. All right, code card. Let's see if we get lucky this time. All right, okay. Uh, so we're starting off with the Palkia. We got the Cosmoium. We got Dialga. And we got Zamazenta. All right. Nothing great there, unfortunately. It's funny how, like, my opinion has changed or my uh, reaction has changed since uh, opening up the first set. Because, like, I was getting really excited for every card that I pulled. But, obviously, the more packs that you open, the more you realize that Oh, okay, these ones are the really common cards. You see which ones are showing up all the time and which ones you hardly get at all. So start off with the Cosmog. Dialga. Kyogre. And hey, hey, Surfing Pikachu VMAX. I think this might be the one that I'm missing. I'll have to check my folder soon, but uh, that's very cool. I like that. Surfing Pikachu VMAX. I will take it, um, even if it is one that we have already got. At least it's uh, something that we can switch out with maybe someone else that wants to do an exchange. All right. And the final pack. Can't believe we're on the final pack already. They just, they go so fast, man. It's actually ridiculous. All right, code card. Come on. Last pack luck. Can we get some lucky here? Cosmog. Reshiram. <gasps> Dark Gyarados, let's go. Oh, that's awesome. All right, so Dark Gyarados, we do get another secret there, and then we get the Professor's Research to finish. Um, Not too bad. I Like, I've definitely seen better. Um, we got the two new secret rares here, plus the Clefo is the bonus one, and I'm pretty sure the Surfing Pikachu VMAX is the new one, um, but I'll just have to double check that. So not too bad overall. Um, we've got the Greninja card as well. Um, it's just about, obviously, turning over enough profit to at least buy another box would be nice. Um, but yeah, I, I think that uh, the cards are common enough in this set for like the Clapper. That's not gonna be worth a hell of a lot, even though it's a secret. Um, and the Mew and Dark Gyarados gonna be new for us, so yeah. But anyway, thank you very much for watching guys. We'll catch you next time. Peace.